So in the previous part we was talking about the, uh, the fact that Max is a path the resort today. Uh, but going way back, uh, there are many other reasons to distrust Microsoft. And I can recall uh, way back in like when I was about 18, so year 2000, uh, Microsoft was known for basically bullying and, comp and, and, and destroying Microsoft. Like companies like uh, Netscape at the time was having a lawsuit. Uh, and I was being exposed a lot to Linux, and I, I basically knew that we weren't given choice, for example, to buy a computer with something else. I guess we had Apple around, and even Apple at the time was really at the mercy of, of Microsoft. So it was very clear that the company had done something to uh, prevent uh, competition from even existing. Uh, and if you look back, and you look at the documents, and I, I did look at several of the documents, especially in the uh, uh, in the cases in the case of Iowa. Uh, you find it very abundantly clear that many of these companies didn't just have complaints against Microsoft; they actually had evidence to show uh, what was done and what was being negotiated inside Microsoft. So, to actually uh, to actually understand the gripe against Microsoft, one has to look at the evidence and not just at the whitewash and the things which. You know, things which were said later to, to make uh, to make myself look a bit more innocent in some ways. Now, I mean, I, I, even as I look, I look, I look down my computer. I mean, I, I had some issues uh, just a moment ago before doing this video uh, with the uh, metaphor in KD of what's called a system train. Now, I don't really know if that's a concept from Microsoft itself. Uh, perhaps supposed to kind of cushion uh, the fall for some people who are used to a. Uh, used to the Microsoft metaphors in the desktop, but it caused me a lot of trouble uh, about 20 minutes now, it's never happened before. Um, and this is the sort of mentality people get to be addicted to even when they went to school. Uh, people were insisting that they should learn uh, the Microsoft methods of doing things, uh, and, and even back then I could understand that this was not just uh, in general.